Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when you are unable to launch Rainbow Six Siege X game from Xbox app or Microsoft Store on your Windows computer. So to fix it, you can close Ubisoft Connect. So if Ubisoft Connect is uh, open over here, uh, you can just make a right click and then quit X, uh, Ubisoft Connect. Once Ubisoft Connect is closed, now click on your profile icon on the Xbox app and then click on sign out and then click on sign in, sign in, select the account which has the game pass and this is for game pass user. Now once you log in with right account, now you can launch the game from here. So you will see the play option. So you can see the play option over here. Now click on play. Now once you click on play, click on yes to allow. Now click on yes to allow. And here you can see it's a uh, launching the game battle eye launcher it's updating and then once battle eye is installed it should launch the game so this may take some time when you click on play it may take some time maybe a couple of seconds or maybe a few minutes but if it's not launching you can just click on play and then click on play multiple times if that does not work then you can open uh, ubisoft connect and then you can try to launch it from here uh, you can go to library and you will see the game over here Try to launch the game from here as well. Now still not working. In that case, uh, you can uh, go to Xbox app and then make a right click on the game and then go to manage and then go to files. And over here, uh, you will see browse option, hit browse. And then over here, find the game exe file over here. And then you can make a double click launch the game from here. If that does not work, you can even make a right click, go to properties, go to this tab, put a check on the box which says run this program as an administrator, hit apply, click on OK, launch the game and then check. If that does not work, you can put a check over here, select Windows 8, hit apply, click on apply and then launch the game. If that does not work, you can even select Windows 7 over here, hit apply, click on OK and launch the game. You can even try disable full screen optimization, hit apply, click on OK, launch the game and then check. Still not working when you put a check on all these boxes still not working in that case you can uncheck these boxes hit apply click on ok and then perform a clean installation of your graphics card driver so if you have nvidia card go to nvidia website if you have amd card go to amd website i'm showing for nvidia so to perform a clean installation go to nvidia website and then select your graphic card from the list make sure that you select your graphic card and then select the right operating system so if you have windows 11 select windows 11 if you have windows 10 select windows 10 and then click on find and once you click on find, you will see this page. Now here you will find the latest GeForce game ready driver. Now click on view. And then once you click on view, you will see the download option. Click on download and let the download complete. Now once the download is complete, run the exe file. Now once you run the exe file, you will see this screen. Click on agree and continue. And then select custom option over here. By default, Express would be selected. Select Custom and then click on Next. And then you will see the screen. Now put a check on the box which says Perform a Clean Installation. Make sure you put a check on Perform a Clean Installation and then click on Next and let the installation complete. Once the installation is complete, restart your computer and after the system restart, launch the game. So that should help you to launch the game successfully. So that will be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.